This evening, we bring you two teams matched up as they've been so many times before. Before the faceoff, Eddie, what do you think? These two teams both need the W here tonight. I can see him playing it safe early, but the question is, which team will make the first mistake? Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. A little over six minutes have been skated here in the first. Neither goalie has made any mistakes so far. It's an onside play. Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. With a shot, and that one hit the glove. Six minutes, 27 seconds. Knocked it away with the stick. The snipers, wow, look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Into the end of attack. Oh, a close call there. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Shot, terrific save, terrific opportunity. Back to the point. Score! Off the iron and in! His mindset's pretty easy. Grip it and rip it. What a slap shot. Edzo, this has to be frustrating. You're in front of the puck, you feel it hit you, and you assume it's in front of you somewhere. However, this one's in the back of the net. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The snipers prevail on the draw. A good, solid pass, and they can move ahead up that right wing. Not on the net. That's what you call there. Grip it and rip it. He just missed it. He scores. We're so far up here, Doc. I'm not sure if that puck got deflected. Let's go down the ray and see what he saw at ice level. Not only was the puck deflected, Edzo, it's through traffic as well. You're going to see on the replay that the goaltender's fighting A, the traffic. He's got to get into position for it. Right when he thinks he's got the puck at him, the puck changes directions. He just can't catch up. And they've won the faceoff. Gets in. What'll he do? Fires a shot. He's got that pass at the point. Had the goalie beat and glanced it off the post. Using the point. One timer. A shot. Terrific glove save, but it's loose. Need to get rid of it. Six remaining. Big shot from the point. Off his head. And the horse. period comes to a close. Wow, what a finish. When the home team wins, you win $10 off at Rob's. When the home team wins, bring your tickets to any Rob's Sporting Goods for a coupon good for $10 off your next purchase. Slovakia's insurance goal has staked them to the two-goal lead that you would expect them to have. Here it is one more time. We'll return after these words. Gets across, looks over his options. Shot. What a save. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Pass cut. Slovakia is controlling the play in their own end. Snapped off a wrist shot. He scores! Three straight goals. The goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. Really good positioning. He's in the butterfly where he's got most of the net covered. But there's obviously a hole in the pucks behind him. 
Slovakia is just continuing to hammer away on the shot board enormous and the score is large. They've got the draw. Gains the zone. Backhander to the net. Wonderful save. Lurks back and throws it. And he's hammered. This is a way to try to spark your team by being physical. Supis is hurt slow to the bench, and as he gets there, the trainer's already waiting for him. And we get another penalty. The referee goes to the penalty timekeeper. Well, you know there are a lot of penalties on the ice when the referee takes out his notepad and pencil. Gets in. What'll he do? Let's a shot fly. Score! What a power play these guys have. The goal scorer put that puck in a shooting position, let it go, and beat the goaltender clean. I don't know what he's going to do with that one, Edzo. That thing is delivered to perfection. Slovakia's got an enormous lead, and it's in the second period. Hopefully, they don't go daydreaming now. Tie up and help from the winger. Looking to Raukin. What a hit! I've lost track with all the hits in this period. Wrist shot. He scores! When you're thinking about taking a wrist shot, it's all about weight transfer. Transferring your weight from your back foot to your front foot when you're shooting that puck. That's exactly what happened there. I think when he takes a look at this on video, he's going to see he was in really good position, and he just wasn't able to stop a perfect shot. Slovakia's lead is already enormous. Will he just sit on this now and get the horn at the end of the second? Oh, broke it up. Blocked away. 40 minutes have been played. A rest is deserved. Are you ready for a walk down memory lane? Then it's time to sign up for our fantasy camp. Play hockey with childhood heroes. It's a fun-filled week full of memories. Call us for details. There are days you choose to be a goalie and you wonder why. This is one such day, and here's an example. We had to break. The snipers wheel one ahead up the wing. Let's it go. Oh, what a quick release on that snapper. Enzo, that zips right on by him. He doesn't get much of this at all. A little under nine minutes have passed here in the third. It has been more lopsided than anyone thought. Five to one. What a strong wrist shot. He got the post with that one. He had that wrist shot ready to go in the perfect scoring area. The goaltender thinks he's in great shape here to make the save. This is a perfect shot delivered to the inside of the goal post. Sometimes you get the bounce, sometimes you don't. This time, the shooter got it. The snipers have gotten one but they still trail by an enormous score. Let's see if they can work on their flow, get their offense going, and maybe get a couple more to be more respectful. Shoots, terrific glove save. A whistle and a rest. I don't know if he's gonna make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. Good stick there, so no complete pass. 
And he steps across the line. Breakaway! Save! The Snipers are lucky they were within a stone's throw of this game, Doc. Their goaltender has saved them so many times, they just can't skate with this team. Score! He's got his second! It's not how hard you shoot it, but it's the release that counts, and he snaps it home. I think if the goaltender's a little more patient here, Eddie, stays up on his feet, he's gonna be able to make the save, but when he drops into the butterfly, that opens up that top glove hole. Slovakia's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is for you. Shoots a wrister. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Freezes play. You can't run around looking for big hits like this. These come right into your lap. The clock is at zeros, the game is over, and the buzzer sounds. This was surgical. You need good hands, Doc, to be a surgeon. They had good hands all night long. And again, we thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the evening as much as we did. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.